Hey, what's happening? This is Tom, NerdRemix.com. I got a movie for you today by a director named James Cullen Bresick. And uh, the movie is called Hate Crime. And the reason it's called Hate Crime, I'll get into it right now. It was uh, directed by, like I said, James Cullen Bresick. It was written by uh, Mr. Bresick and uh, Jarrett Cohen. Um, Hate Crime centers around a family that uh, they're celebrating a birthday and, uh, you know, Dad's videotaping the uh, birthday celebration, and uh, the celebration is cut short by a home invasion of three masked men who happen to be neo-Nazis, and the family happens to be Jewish, apparently. And uh, basically, the film centers around them terrorizing the family and uh, brutalizing the family. And uh, it's uh, the guys are only identified as one, two, and three. Um, it's kind of a found footage movie. And that, uh, you know, there's a lot of shaky camera work, a lot of different stuff. Kind of reminded me of the August Underground stuff, if you've ever seen that. Though not nearly as graphic. But uh, there's definitely an unflinching look at a hate crime in this movie. And uh, this is definitely a, a brutal, gritty uh, type film. Um, lots of realism, like I said. Uh, very believable. Um, the actors involved, uh, everybody does a great job. Uh, particularly the, uh, the guy that plays the father. Um, his name escapes me. Sorry, I didn't pay that much attention to the credits. Anyway, Hate Crime, it's, uh, it's well shot for a found footage film. There's a few skips in the audio. I don't know if that was the uh, fact that I was streaming the screener from uh, Vimeo or if that was uh, just, you know, the way it was designed to look. But, yeah, lots of grainy, uh, gritty video type footage in this and uh, pretty, some pretty graphic scenes that really make you cringe and really make you uh, feel sorry for the, uh, the family involved, definitely, because uh, they're really uh, put through the mill by these uh, home invaders, these uh, neo-Nazi type guys, and uh, very unflinching, brutal film. So, uh, you know, audio-wise, like I said, there's a few glitches, but that could be, uh, you know, intentional as to, you know, kind of give you the, the more uh, found footage feel. It's not a, like a, a Blur Witch thing where you got, you know, you get people blowing snot bubbles into the camera and stuff. It's a pretty violent film, and. Uh, it kind of, you know, like I said, August Underground, it kind of reminded me of that. A little bit of Last House on the Left maybe thrown in there, so uh, that was cool too. And uh, a really, really unflinching, convincing um, look at a hate crime. I mean, you could show somebody actual clips from this movie and they could actually believe that it's, you know, not fiction, as it were. So uh, definitely check out Hate Crime. Uh, I, I'm pretty excited to see what uh, Mr. Bresick has. Um, else in his canon. Uh, I got a review of another movie of his coming up and uh, definitely check it out. I give uh, Hate Crime from uh, written and direct, uh, written by uh, James, Cullen Bre James Cullen Bresick and uh, Jarrett Cohn and directed by Mr. Bresick. I give Hate Crime a 7 out of 10. A firm 7 out of 10. Uh, very good film. Check it out when it comes out if you can uh, handle things of that genre and uh, if you can handle an unflinching look at a actual hate crime almost. So pretty convincing. 7 out of 10. I'm Tom. Support Independent Cinema. Thanks. Huge cloud of shit. Wow. God, I think I smell it. Come on, let's go.